Hello, it's uh, Richard Sace, Mr. Ricardo again. Uh, we're at Bargy Fresh and I'm going to cook a lamb patia the way they, uh, they cook it in the, in the takeaway here. Okay, the pan's very hot, so I'm going to put some oil in. Three to four tablespoons like that. That's quite a lot, so maybe take a bit off. Take a little bit off. So, with oil in the pan, it's nice and hot already. So, fresh garlic paste. Yep. Just a bit there. I'll lift it off the heat actually because it's um, it's getting well done. And to that, we're going to add onions. onions. Okay. There we go. Nicely browned. Okay. Got the heat sort of medium-ish. Medium. The onions will protect the garlic from um, burning. Uh, yeah, we're going to add a bit of base to help steam the onions. Thank you, chef. Just a touch to begin with. And that is to help cook the onions, soften them. So you've turned it up high now. Yeah, turned it up high. Half a teaspoon of salt. A bit more. Just a bit more. Perfect. Yep. Kasori methi. Perfect. Yep. The mixed powder that goes in. Just uh, perfect. Yep. So we've got about two teaspoons yep. of chili powder there. Keep the heat down on the Yep. So we keep the heat down once the powdered spices have gone in. Sugar? Yeah, because it's a patty, yeah? Yeah. We're going to add a little bit of sugar, yeah? About that much? Perfect. Yep. Mix that. Yep. Yeah, and tomato puree. Tomato puree. Perfect. Yep. And, lemon, and lemon, some lemon juice. Lemon juice. So on. Okay. Perfect. Yep. Now you mix it. Uh huh. Yeah, all the spices blended. And then we put in. Put about 13 teaspoons. Is that enough? Yep, that's perfect. There we go. Now mix it. Okay, so giving it a good mix. You definitely want a job on Saturday, don't you? Hey? <laughs> <laughs> it's a room for me though. So the chef's going to add some um, some more base gravy. He's doing a good job holding the camera at the same time. Can I put the heat full? Yep, heat's up full. There we go. Yep, well, Look at that. It. Mix it together. Yep. So patia is a sweet and sour and hot curry. So that's where the sugar, lemon juice. Yeah, it's got a good flavour to that curry actually. You can taste the flavour, sweetness, yeah. sourness. Yeah. When it says sweet and sour, it sounds mm -hmm. a bit like Chinese. It does. But actually it's got a lot of flavour to it. One of, the, one of the good sellers as well. Right, put the heat down a bit so you see. Yeah. Yeah. Perfect. Okay. Right. That's perfect. We're just going to uh, leave that now. About three, three minutes. Three minutes. I'll be back with you shortly. Just give it a little bit longer. Right. We're done now. The chef's going to dish it up. Magic. Thank you. As you can see, it's getting very busy in the kitchen. It's only a Wednesday. It's very early evening. I can only imagine what it's like on a Saturday night. Right, let's have a taste. This gorgeous lamp is here. Can't wait any longer. Mm. Oh yeah, that lamb is so good. And the sauce is perfectly balanced. <clears throat> the balance of flavours and the way it's cooked really bring this all together into a fantastic dish. Well, thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe. Click the bell icon. This is uh, Richard Sage signing out from Bargy Fresh in Warrington. Thanks very much to the chef Abdul Malik and the staff here. There's plenty more to come. So, see you soon.